Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Heart Gold, Soul Silver, kind of Nuzlocke, but not really randomizer thing. <laughs> so I trained Pokemon and this is the team. I got Row up to level 30. Uh, I think Swords Dance is new. I don't remember. Uh, but yeah, Confusion and Slash could do with getting him something like Psycho Cut, I think it is. The, f the actual physical psychic move, since his attack is way higher than his special. I got Operate to level 30, he knows Water Pulse now, uh, Dirt Mode level 30, Ice Fang, Icy Wind, Protect Bite, so basically just knows, knows Ice Fang, which is new. Uh, Day, the Bee Drill, Pursuit, Extra Sensory, Toxic Spikes, and Twin Needle. I got a Fury, Fury Strike, so, so, I don't know, it's Fury something for Toxic Spikes, I thought that might come in handy later. We got Caster to level 30, those Payback, Sucker Punch, Confuse Ray, and Shadow Punch. And finally, I got Seth to level 30, and he evolved Dragonair, which I didn't know, I thought it was higher than that, but there you go. And he knows Surf, Dragon Rage, Thunder Wave, and Slam. So I don't think there's anything new there. But we've uh, now got to face the, uh, the gym leader. And uh, my Pokemon, if you remember before, were like mid 20s or something. And getting them to 30 was such a pain. <laughs> there was like, there's nowhere good to train, basically. But yeah, let's do it. Thank you for your help at the lighthouse, but this is different. Please allow me to introduce myself. I am Jasmine, a gym leader. I use the Clang Steel type. Do you know about Steel type? They are very hard, cold, sharp, and really strong. Um, I'm not lying. So I think the normally in the game, the only Steel type you see up to this point is like Magnemite. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's uh, Cyndaquil. Should have started with the uh, water type, so let's go to operate. And let's use Surf. It's dead. Easy. Drifloon. Hmm. I could use Caster. No, I'll use Dirtner, I think. I think Drifloon's ghost flying, I want to say. So bite should do decent damage. Yeah, it does, but she does a lot. Well, yeah, she does a lot of damage to me. Stockpile, huh? I spit up. That's fine. Why well, it took me with it though? That's fine. I don't get to know what I'm switching into, so I'll just switch into operate. Huntail. Ooh, level 35. That's a pain. I'm gonna yawn you. Nice thing does nothing. Brian does nothing. One more. Hyper potion. Great. Let's use yawn. And I'll use my own super potion. I can hear my dog barking. <laughs> oh well. Sorry about that. Nothing I can do. Uh, Confusion, more confusion. One last confusion. Oh my god, that's so annoying. One more. There you go. It's dead. Okay. You are a better trainer than me in both skill and kindness. In accordance with the league rules, I can further this badge. We got the mineral badge from Jasmine. With that badge, all Pokemon include traded Pokemon up to level 70 will obey. Uh, you wear that question. Um, please take this too. TM23. Which contained Iron Tail, which I don't think it is. It's actually... Uh, this way. TM, lucky Champ, so useless, basically. Okay. So now that we've beaten Jasmine, we need to do the uh, seventh gym. So, um, while I was training, I was basically surfing around on this route down here and like around the world and stuff and I'm pretty sure there were more than just one route down there that I could catch Pokemon at but I'm not really too bothered with what the Pokemon there were I think it was like Bagon which would have been nice because of Salamence but I've already got you know Dragonair so I don't need another Dragon type then there was Eradicate which I'm really not bothered with and then the only thing that would have been nice was the Magmortar, but it wasn't ever my first encounter. 
so it was like the rare one of that route. So oh, and there was a rare raid, but I don't need that. Um, so yeah, I don't really mind too much about missing it and stuff. So that's why I didn't record it or anything. I don't know why I'm going to the Pokemon Center here again, but there you go. Uh, let's move on, I guess. Oh, and I, w I did go this way. I went through there a little bit through Mount Mortar, and there was like an item on the floor, I think. Or maybe. Maybe it was an item around here or something? Anyway, yeah, it was it was on here. There was an item, and it was like here, and it was a King Rock. And then I haven't been down there, obviously. And I didn't get an encounter on this route. So technically, I could use this encounter. I think we could use here. I think this is the encounter you get with Suicune, but do I want to use Cut on someone? <laughs> I guess I'll teach you today. Why not? Uh, actually, I do like Day's moves though. Cut 50, Twin Needles. Mm. You know, I do kind of like these. No, stop trying to uh, I'm not going to teach you to row, actually. I'm going to instead you teleport. And then I'll go to the PC and teach it to a Pokemon there, I guess. Uh, let's see. Move Pokemon. Who? Oh, yeah, I can use any, I guess. Who had cut before? Was it. Was it Quan? Yeah. Okay, I'll just switch out. Caster, I guess, for right now. And then just move you to box one. Just so I don't forget. Go. Uh, this way. I'll probably get an account now. <laughs> Unless I have a repel or something, which I don't think I do. Oh, I do. Why not? Oh, I want to switch to operate first, actually, if it is the encounter, because operate knows how to put to sleep. Watch it be something terrible like a canopy. Cut. Calm use cut. Eaten. So this is an encounter. Suicune, how brave it is, how refreshing it is, how beautiful it is, and how quickly it moves. You seem to be around where Suicune would appear. Well, that's okay. My third search for Suicune is far beyond yours. My grandpa was quite into myths. I've heard so many stories about Suicune from him. Suicune, I won't stop following you until I find out what you're after. You hear me? Okay, so that wasn't the encounter at all then. <laughs> My bad. I feel like I detoured for no reason. I wonder what you catch or encounter Suicune then. Oh well, moving on. We've already been this way, we've already been to this town in fact. And we know that something is uh, fishy and going on. Move Pokemon. I'll bring back. Caster. Okay, just I'm gonna move you back because I know you're dead. <laughs> These are the only ones that like didn't die. Basically, I think. Wow. Oops. You know, I, I think a couple of the others didn't die, but I traded them in. <laughs> it's kind of funny how my pseudo Wudo was a Meryl, but then I got a pseudo Wudo anyway. Um, I don't. Yeah. Yeah, because 10 and B was still alive, technically. But they traded it in. And so was Jay and I think Granny. I basically just killed everyone for this team. Anyway. I think my Pokemon will be under leveled for that gym, actually. Do you sell stuff? No. 
Do you still? So, no, you don't. Okay. It's a weird tree, isn't it? I wonder if that has something to do with the plot. Okay, so this is a new route. And I can catch a Pokemon on here, I guess. Need around female. Is dead. Spearow. Is dead. Torkoal. Is dead. <laughs> Easy peasy. So let's. Alright, we have to go. Through. That building at some point, I think. Now you go into the Lake Ridge too. Let's play for a little while. Get a Corfish. It's dead. It's kind of strange. No, I'm not <laughs> giving you my number. It's strange how the Pokemon now the trainers have are like low 20s, and the gym leader from Aldervine had like a Pokemon that was 35, you know? 30, 35. Operate still 31. Look, I don't know. I guess they have to balance it out and gym leaders have got to be strong anyway. No, I'm not giving you my number. All these people wanted my number. Let's get this Pokeball. Fresh water. Can I... Ah, Team Rocket. Hold it there, kiddo. The toll is 1,000 to go through. Thank you very much. Okay, so they... Yeah, they automatically take it. Fight me. Get a gold duck. And it's dead. Dipman's level 31. Ooh, crunch. Nice. Better better than bite. You can fight me too. Some redhead guy or something. Nobody cares, let's be honest. Oh, why am I... It's a dark type. What the hell am I doing? I'm an idiot. Okay, that's... Okay, first beat patch of grass. And the Pokemon is... Sandshrew. I'll... Put you to sleep, I guess. Now you sleep. And I'll use... Pokeball. And record it. If it fell from a great height, this Pokemon could save itself by rolling into a ball and bouncing. Um, that doesn't sound fun <laughs> at all. Hmm, what should I call this Pokemon? I will call it... I don't know what to call it. Hmm, I know, since it can roll into a ball, which is a circle, and O is a circle, and there's two of them, I'll call it Loop. <laughs> that logic is flawless. He's in the grave, accidentally. Oh well. Uh, Lake of Rage. So this is also a new route. Hi there, buddy. Uh, great fill rainwater. You don't understand what's happening. Okay. Usually blue. The arrows are angry, it's bad omen. I'm sure. Oh, I know what I've got to do. <laughs> oh, but see, I'm so nervous about. Yeah, I'm doing it. If I if I get an encounter before I get to that Gyarados, I'm not counting it. I just want people to know. It's my rules now. <laughs> because this is a special encounter. God fucking damn it. Why is it a piece of shit like that? Basically, the, this Gyarados is an, like an event, right? An event Pokemon, and it's always shiny. And I was hoping I'd get a cool shiny, but now I get a stupid Sunflora. So I actually don't really care about it. I'm going to try and catch it, but if I don't, then I don't. Okay, and now I'll throw a Pokeball. Sunflower is like awful. <laughs> I caught it in one. Very good. 
It converts sunlight into energy. In the darkness after sunset, it closes its petals and becomes still. Very cool. Let's give it a nickname. Hmm, let's see. I mean, just an obvious name like Sunny comes to mind because it's a sunflower. Hmm. Yeah, Sunny. Why not? That sounds pretty good to me. Sunny the sunflower. I'm never going to use it anyway, so. I also obtained the red scale. Oh, look, weird guy with the Dragonite. Hi. The red Gyarados wasn't acting right. As I feared, somebody must have forced it to evolve. Did you come here because of the Wild Tales? Your monkey and Lance, like you, I heard some rumbling, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, would you help me investigate? Sure. Excellent. It seems that the Lake of Rage's magic carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast going from Mahogany is probably the cause. And that suspicious souvenir shop. I'll be waiting for you in Mahogany. Yeah, you, you can fly? Well, I have Row and Row can teleport. So, beat it. Mine's psychic. So, yeah, I win, obviously.